Hi everyone, today we're diving into an essential tool for network security called XRP. If you've ever worried about someone intercepting your data or hacking your network, this video is for you. We'll explore what XRP is, how it works, and how you can use it to protect your devices from RP spoofing attacks. So what is XRP? So what exactly is XRP? XRP stands for Extended Address Resolution Protocol. It's a security tool designed to detect and prevent ARP spoofing attacks. How XARP works. XARP helps protect your network by monitoring ARP traffic and detecting any suspicious activity. It uses both active and passive techniques to analyze ARP requests and replies, looking for patterns that indicate a possible attack. When XRP detects something unusual, it alerts you immediately, allowing you to take action before any damage is done. Best practices and final thoughts. While XRP is a powerful tool, it's just one part of a comprehensive network security strategy. Here are a few best practices to keep in mind. One, regularly monitor your network for suspicious activity. Two, use strong, unique passwords for your Wi-Fi network. Three, keep your router and all connected devices updated with the latest firmware. Four, consider using a VPN for an extra layer of security. By combining XRP with these practices, you can significantly reduce the risk of ARP spoofing and other network attacks. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up for more tips on keeping your digital life secure. Also, if you're interested in diving deeper, I've written two articles that you might find useful. One, how to use XRP to detect and prevent ARP spoofing attacks on your computer. Two, how to stop a confirmed ARP spoofing attack using Kali Linux. You can find the links to these articles in the first comment below this video. They include all the necessary commands and detailed information to help you further secure your network. If you have any questions or want to share your experiences with XARP, drop a comment below. Stay safe and I'll see you in the next video.